Ho ho ho! Merry Christmas! Good day, guys! Welcome back to Language of the M on this week's Trias 5. K1 HP is 100%, damage deal is double 100%, and damage taken is reduced by 50%. And that's only for the enemy and for the hero, they are from the medial team. However, we'll be playing this special team just for trying out. So, we'll be using Nani Nani, Vincent, well, Kirito. Bozo and Licorice, and of course, if you do not have Kirito, aka Evil God, Vin uh, Evil God Kruger, so you can feel free to change back to Immortals Rachel. And for Vincent, you can change to again another Magic AOE characters or Physical Damage Dealer. So, alright. Without further ado, let's get into formation. So, apparently, the good thing about Vincent's tree C is that it's global effect so you can just debuff on any characters you want on the map as long as well they are not immune to negative effect so the good thing about this tree is that it will help boost his damage because for every debuff enemy have it will increase his damage by two percent uh, to a maximum of four or five at rank six because mine is just rank four So, as per the timeless law, so if apparently the enemy's HP are 100%, which is full, they will deal twice the amount of damage against you. So, we definitely got to blast AoE towards them. And we got to make sure they are not at 100% HP. So, before we advance to try to attack or further deal additional AoE damage to them. So, alright, and Kyuga's gonna go egg again, cast a shield for Nani Nani Sherry because she's gonna try to attack Nani Nani Sherry. Then we're gonna go with his 3C and blast all the enemy with additional debuff. And of course, here we go. So, we're gonna do a 3C on Nani Nani Sherry and get your HP recovered. Then we're gonna attack the closest enemy we can, which is Freya. One thing to take note is that Freya will be able to heal her teammate. So you can see they are back to 100% health. So you got to be careful and cast additional debuff against the enemy or just cast AoE damage to make sure they are not retaining their HP at 100%. So, hmm. All right, just to play safe, I'll cast Earthquake to reduce the intelligence of Shafanel because well she's an AoE damage, so that's not safe. Okay, but at this point of time it's okay for Nani Nani to perish or die or retire. So okay. The most important character will be our AoE or mage heroes. Just make sure they are alive. Because you can get to spam all your spells. So alright, Kruger will move to these positions and cast Darkness Dragon Bath. So as you can see, we are dealing additional damage thanks to his talent and the debuff that enemy has. Alright, service time, 3C of Kruger. Okay, since I have no skills for Licorice, and basically I'll just use Bozo, that hole, and Everyone's gonna take it and only left with Luna and now Licorice will do us the honor of taking out Luna. So that's it for Trias 5. So of course if you do not have characters like Vincent or Kruger, feel free to change or swap them out for um, better magic AoE dealers like Rachel's and probably a tanker like Huda or Landis. So right, moving to character's item build. So for Bozo, remember to give him as much magic defense and his explosive because he turns magic defense into intelligence. For Licorice, give her intelligence and HP and healing percentage. And for Vincent, just try to give him as much damage as much as you can. And of course, um, Judgment Talisman to go against Holy. And then Kuga. So yep, um, just rip this item from Rachel, so the usual stuff, increase intelligence and HP. 
and four glory of light or meteor faction so we have nani nani so just boost as much of her attack and hp as you can and that will be fine sorry we've come to the end remember to like and subscribe see you guys on the next video bye bye